let us solve exercise 5.1 now this exercise is based on the slope we have seen few examples let us discuss these examples find the slope of the lines whose inclinations are 45 degrees 30 degrees and 90 degrees which formula will you use very simple for slope we have only two formulas m is equal to tan theta and m is equal to y2 minus y1 upon x2 minus x1 i am repeating this formula again and again so that will hammer your ears and your brain to and you will remember those formulas very simple m is equal to tan theta tan 45 is 1 tan 30 what is tan 30 1 upon root 3 and what is tan 90 tan 90 is not defined okay next find the slope of the lines passing through the following points now this example or the question has a three sub points that is 1 a minus 2 1 b 0 3 now two points are given you have to find out the slope of the line and this appeared in October 14 paper for two marks such a simple example you have to just find a slope of the line two points are given and two marks isn't it a bonus so next is P and Q P is 1 minus 1 and Q is minus 2 phi I'm not writing on the board because the book is in front of you just open 5.1 exercise 5.1 and read the book along with me okay the third now this example appeared in March 15 exam for two marks again points are C 3 5 and D minus 2 minus 3 very simple just you have to apply the formula M slope is equal to y2 minus y1 upon x2 minus x1 please pause your video here and solve this example and also check the answer at the back of the book okay please do that now there are total six examples in this for the fourth fifth and sixth again two two points are given please solve those examples also now we'll see the example number three using the slope concept check whether the following points are collinear or not now in this six sub questions are there in every sub questions three points are given let us see the first point the first a 7 8 b minus 5 2 and c 3 6 you have to show that these three points are collinear how you will do that we know that if a b c are the point find out the slope of a b and find out the slope of b c if those slopes are same then since b point is your common point if the a b and c are the points if a b slope of a b and slope of b c are same b point is common so the points are collinear you have to use the same method for all six sub examples okay so please pause your video here and solve exercise 5.1 question number three please do it now then we'll go ahead example number four find the value of k we have seen such example find the value of k if minus 3 11 6 2 and k 4 are collinear points this example appeared in july 15 for three marks okay now how will you solve this if three points are given suppose this is the line a b c let us say that minus 3 11 6 2 minus 3 11 6 2 and third point is k 4 what they are given these points are collinear what do you mean by these points are collinear these points are collinear means the slope of a b and slope of b c are same you can easily find out the slope of AB because all four numerals are given. But in case of slope of BC, it will be in terms of K somewhere. 
since both are equal so you will get an equation let us solve this example so let us take AB first so I'll write like this MAB is equal to MBC that is slope of AB and slope of BC are equal slope of AB are 2 minus 11 upon 6 minus of minus 3 don't calculate it on the spot there and there itself you may miss the answer so first write this into bracket minus 3 and on the next step you solve that and here we have 4 minus 2 and k minus 6 so here we have minus 9 and 6 plus 3 that is 9 equal to 4 minus 2 is 2 upon k minus 6 so we have minus 1 here so ultimately we will get k minus 6 is equal to minus 2 so k is equal to 4 very simple extremely simple example okay I'm just discussing this point this part you can do it by your own it is very easy so this is how when the three collinear points are given and in one of the coordinates it is missing this is how you find out the unknown value or missing value let us go ahead show that example number five show that four points are given are the vertices of a parallelogram again draw a rough figure of parallelogram okay find out the slopes of all the lines and then show that the pair of lines that the two lines have got same slope so those two lines are parallel and since this is a quadrilateral we can say that this quadrilateral is a parallelogram we already seen this example let us go ahead a b c d coordinates are given a 0 0 b 7 2 c 7 7 and d 2 7 are the vertices of a quadrilateral they are already given that these are the vertices of a quadrilateral find a slope of its diagonals very simple diagonals draw figure draw diagonals and in the diagonal you will have the coordinates two points you know two coordinates you know you can easily find out the slope of the two coordinates correct please pause your video here and solve this example in this case the quadrilateral is your a b c and d correct and your a c and b d are the diagonals you have the coordinate of a you have coordinate of c so you have to find out the slope of line a c how you will do that y2 minus y1 upon x2 minus x1 similarly the slope of db is y2 minus y1 upon x2 minus x1 the slopes of ac is slope of ac is 1 and slope of bd is minus 1 alternatively you can check your answers at the back of the books answers are given for each exercise at the back of the book please verify your answers when you are solving your examples don't forget sometimes those answers can be wrong okay don't forget about this the vertices of a triangle are a b and c find a slope of each side of triangle a b c very easy draw a triangle a b and c all the vertices are given that means for every line you have two coordinates find out the slope y2 minus y1 upon x2 minus x1 please pause your video and solve this example show that the line joining minus 1 1 and minus 9 6 is parallel to line joining minus 2 14 and 6 9 how will you show that these two lines are uh, parallel how will you show these two lines are parallel find out the slope of both the lines if the slope of both the lines is same that means those lines are parallel please pause your video and solve this example show the slope of both the lines are same next example if the slope of line joining points k minus 3 and 4 5 is 1 by 2 find the value of k again very simple example points two points are given 
and the slope is directly given. So m is equal to y2 minus y1 upon x2 minus x1. Now in this case m is given and one of the coordinate is missing, is unknown, which is denoted by k. So please pause your video here and solve this example. The exercise 5.1 was very very easy. Okay, we just had to discuss some uh, few examples and you solve those examples. So now let us go ahead and start the topic equation of line. Thank you.